Robin is quite controlled. Here's what's going to happen, OK? Neatly dressed. She wears a lot of pencil skirts and structured dresses. She's kind of containing herself the whole time. And the reason why she's like that is because her actual home life is spinning out of control. <laughs> How people present and what pieces of themselves they choose to share with the world is something that I think everybody can relate to on some level. You choose what your profile picture is going to be on your social media page. You choose what filter you're going to put on your, your face at when, you know, when you take a picture at someone's birthday party and post it on your Instagram, whatever. Like, everyone does it. She does wear a lot of black, but what I liked about this is it had a little bit of pattern in it. It looks like a bit of a busy fabric, but it's a very structured dress. And I think Anna sort of felt when she put these on in the fitting, it was a good example of what her character is actually like. What's going on inside is just all over the place. I'm not going to fire you. <sighs> Thank you. She's an interesting character, Caroline, because I think she sort of PRs herself. I don't care if you lie. She's made a very strong, ferocious character. What you see is not necessarily who she is as well. So this is an example of one of Caroline's outfits. It's a very structured jacket. The idea for her was to sort of nip in the waist and have very full, quite long skirts. It gives her a lot of presence in the office, tops that are one colour on one side, one colour on the other. It's very linear. And her hair's like that as well. I'm wearing this preen dress. and I can't actually lift my arms. So I'm like kind of wearing a straight jacket, which really suits Caroline. She uses the minimum amount of movement all the time. Slightly kind of ageing Audrey Hepburnish. <laughs> she's got the London look. She's a posh girl. She's fun and she's naughty. She's really naughty. Yeah. Uh -huh. There's something quite sort of butch about the way yeah. she manages her business life. She likes shoulder pads and she yeah. likes to power dress. These women are bossing around powerful celebrities. But she needs to be kind of ahead of the curve, yeah. which is why she sort of needs to look on point all the time. Yeah. It's quite traditional, but it's incredibly well cut. So, but she's got leather trousers on with it. A little bit more sort of funky and edgy. Then a piece of very expensive jewellery over the top of it. Eve's quite sarcastic. I quite like when clothes are a bit sarcastic. They're like, yeah. yeah. Added that to that as well. That was in, a, in the club. It was cool because it was yeah. slightly dreamy. <laughs> Palm has amazing stuff, and uh -huh. stuff that you'd see on the rack and not know how yeah. it actually sits, but then you put it on and you yeah. feel a bit sort of superhero. -y. Yeah, I like it because it's got a bold stripe, and there is something quite bold about it. <laughs> this is his naughtiest garment. Because um, it goes little. <laughs> Did you dress yourself? Very nice pumpkin. She looks like she's been kidnapped by a murderer and dressed in his mother's clothes. <laughs> but as soon as she sort of turns up, you meet people like Caroline and Eve and Robin, and they are so much more put together. She's quite innocent. Everything's a bit mismatched. I found all these animal prints, which I love. There's a couple of, like, favourites that I've got for her. Why are you being weird? Have you farted? The shrimp sweater. Yep. It's slightly teenage. She has, like, this red zebra shirt thing that comes in a bit, like, halfway through her, becoming a bit more confident. <sighs> Having such a fun night. We get to enjoy her fashion trends becoming more finessed as we go through the series. She starts to sort of dress a bit more demurely not quite as outlandish navies rather than pinks. It, it's more mature, but we've still got a little bit of pattern on, on there somewhere, so she hasn't lost her identity completely. Are you coming to get drunk with us or not? OK. 